Hello and thank you for watching this how-to video for iText Apprises PDF to Data. This video is the first in a series of videos showcasing the table selector within PDF to Data. Okay, let's sign into PDF to Data and let's create a new template. Uh, we'll give our template a name. Let's just call it demonstration template. Let me select my reference invoice from my local machine here. Click open and create the template. Okay, so notice it's loaded in an invoice as a PDF and already it's gone to work for us. As you can see here with the plus sign, it's already recognized the existence of a table. And without any effort, all I have to do is click on this plus sign. And as you can see over here, it's created a new field. It's already selected the table selector. It's already selected the headers. And if I go ahead and create this field, you can see down below here that it's going to extract four rows and four columns. And if I click on show table, you can see the four columns, Q, description, unit cost, and total, and then each of the rows with their respective values. That's an example of the table selector doing the work for us in automatic mode. 